Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, quick tip Thursday. This is really going to be a quick one. Um, I got this tease set up here, right? And I got all these layers. I got a video, and then I put it like a blue wash on it. And then right here, I added this glow pop effect on it. And up here, I, then I next layer, I have uh, the sort of mortise shell, whatever you want to call it, for the tease look for the shell, right? Now, imagine I want to get something else above this glow uh i don't know what that would be uh off the top of my head i don't but imagine i needed something to go on v4 i've seen people try to move go like this and move <laughs> and move this all up one layer right don't do that okay i'm going to show you the quickest trip uh trick right now control alt y it will, t it will come up, add track. What track do you want to do? I'm going to say video track four. It'll say, do you, this track already exists. Do you want to insert it? Yes, I do. And now everything else above that moves up, okay? Don't be that guy that cl clicks all the, the things and starts moving it up a layer. If you need everything on a whole track, control alt y insert the track. I'm going to do another one. Now I have two tracks if I needed to add videos here. It kind of works in the same way in audio. To me, in audio, you don't really need to lift, uh, sort of make room in the same way you do for video. So if you're ever in, in that situation where you need a track, but you don't want to lift everything off the track you have, just hit Control-Alt-Y. Hit the number you want to track, OK, and insert it. Yes, and there it goes again. So that's Quick Tip Thursday. Uh, enjoy the weekend. I'm going to drink, I think this weekend, Lawson's Super Session number 8, one of my favorite IPAs. Have a great weekend, everybody. I'll see you next week. Some people think Avid is really hard to learn, but that is not the case. And now there's an online course to prove it. Get all of the info and all of the details at avidbeer.com.